folks who don't have uh, our, don't have the books or whatever, you need to find a table of KBs. Yep. And you could the, one of the common ones is this thing called methyl methylamine. Uh, methylamine. Let's do methylamine first because he's easier. You'll find yep. him, and his formula is CH3. NH2. Yep. And what we know about this character is that he is 75 milliliters and it's 0 0.30 molar. So his millimoles are, Mr. Sams is going to take uh, M right, we got times 22. V, 22.5 millimoles. And then the methyl ammonium, our ammonium is just going to have one more H. That's CH3 NH3 positive. And that's reacted with, technically it's CH3 NH3, NO3. But the nitrate breaks apart, or breaks off, and you're left with this guy right yep, here. Nitrate never affects pH. Nitrate doesn't affect pH. So it's 0 0.50 molar, and it's 25 milliliters. So when you multiply those out, how 12. many millimoles? 5. We have 12 and a half millimoles. Now, do we have a buffer? We do. So with a buffer, we can use the? Henderson Hasselbach. So we now have our numbers, 12.5 and 22.5. Now, we do have a particular instance. So when you look in your table in the back of your book or in a table, we can look up the KB of a methyl ammoni, uh, methylamine, CH3 and H2. And that value, Mr. Sams, is what from your book? Here? It is uh, 4.38 times 10 to the negative 4. Now, in the... Uh, Henderson Hasselbach equation. It says right. pH equals pKa. A. This is a KB. Yep. So I need to find the KA. And yep. remember, the KW divided by the KB equals the KA. A. Or that comes from the equation KA times KB equals KW. So when you get the KA, you get 2.28 times 10 to the negative 11. And of course, we're going to find the pKa. So if you take the negative log of this value here, you'll get the pKa, and that'll be 10 and some change. Am I correct? Uh, yeah, it is. Sorry, hang on. Mr. Uh, Sams is fierce. I was starting on something else. 10.6. 10.6. So you've got to find the pKa. So there's a little additional step here if you have a base problem. So now we can use our Henderson Hasselbalch equation. pH equals 10.76. 10.6. Ten point six four if you want another six thing. Ten point six four plus the log of the base over the acid. So let's go back and figure out who was the base and who was the acid. Alright, the base is the methylamine. And his conjugate acid is the methyl ammonium. So it'll be twenty two and a half over twelve and a half. So I'll say twenty two point five divided by twelve point five. And that's it, folks. Ten point six four plus this log and you're done. We get 10.90. 10.90. So that's the pH of this solution. The only trick on this particular problem is understand this Ka, Kb, Kw thing. Um, and probably the other trick is this screen here, is that you have to understand who is who. Actually, I think this is the problem everybody has, is to understand which chemicals you're dealing with. Methyl ammonium, nitrate, that sounds like just this horrible thing to name. But if you find methyl amine, then they're giving you his partner, and you ignore, you cross him out, the nitrate. You have methyl ammonium. Okay? Folks, um, this will get you lots of things to get started on the whole concept of acids and bases, acid base buffers, because you see, I am buff. You know, I've been taking, I think about taking a, a, a trip, Mr. Sams. Oh, yeah, where to? I was thinking about buying a, well, it's actually where. Well, I was going to the Milwaukee, oh, but yeah, it's right, a new vehicle. I was thinking about getting a new vehicle oh, to yeah. get me there. What do you get? I was going to get the Millennium Falcon. Millennium Falcon? Yeah. Oh, I mean, like, think Star Wars? Yeah. Oh, that'd be kind it of might cool. fly me there faster than hyperspace. hyperspace. Yeah. 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 I've also been a little bit hungry lately. Oh, yeah. What are you It's kind of around lunch. I was going to get some moldy bread. Ugh. Yeah, I know it. Yeah. That's not very good. Well, it's a lot of protein. Yeah. Well, we promised you a short podcast, and we lied. We're sorry. <laughs> Have a great day. Bye, Bye. guys.